Folks who use public transportation say they're seeing more and different faces getting on board. Across the region, transportation agencies and companies say ridership is up. Ross Goddotti is live with why many people are now leaving the driving to someone else. Ross. Yeah, the question is, is pain at the pump prompting more people to park their car and take public transportation? Well, the answer may be probably, but it's not the only reason. Deidre DeBucci says she walks a fair amount of hours as a Westmoreland County Transit Authority bus rider. Three or four times a week, if not more. And she says she's now noticing something on her trips to Pittsburgh and back. Seems like there is a lot more folks that take the bus. The Westmoreland County Transit Authority says Deidre's passenger perceptions aren't wrong. In the last three months, um, March, April, and May, when we compare that to 2021, we're seeing about a 30% increase in ridership. And the WCTA is not alone when it comes to increased ridership. I spoke to transit directors and bus company officials in Beaver, Butler, Washington, and Allegheny counties who say their seats are filling up in part because it costs so much for everybody to fill up their tanks. Again, gas prices has to be at the top of that list. But not the only one. Everyone says people heading back to work post-pandemic could also be a reason, but quite a few people we spoke to feel like they're being thrown under the bus by fuel prices when you consider you can ride a bus to Pittsburgh for the cost of just a gallon of gas. And just in um, Westmoreland County, to go to Pittsburgh, it's $6 one way. I feel it's easier to get around um, and the gas prices are too high. I ride the bus and it's saving me a lot of money. <laughs> And my carbon footprint has shrunk significantly. All right, one group not being directly impacted by these high fuel prices, interestingly enough, are a lot of transit agencies. Why? Because many of them, several years ago, transitioned from diesel fuel to liquid natural gas. Now, while that is more expensive than in years past, it's still much cheaper than diesel or gasoline. Reporting live in Greensburg, Roscadotti, KDKA News.